Yo boy, this is gonna be a fun video. Hello everybody, welcome to a brand new video. Today we are here to review the SA Figure Arts. Oh shit, sorry. The SA Figure Arts Super Saiyan Trunks, the boy from the future. <laughs> well, that's accurate, but yeah. Yes, I have trunks and uh, this is finally, after a long time, this man finally has a 2.0 figure. The last trunks I have that's still that's still pretty good this video day is his super count part. And that's a good figure. I bought that around 2018 at Anime Jungle when I was on my trip when I was on a Christmas trip in California. Yeah, uh <laughs> anyway, we're, anyway, we're gonna talk about we're gonna talk about the good and the bad about this guy, cuz. Yeah, I got a lot of things to say about trunks. Alright, first off articulation wise. This is how far he goes for here and for here as well. So yeah, you can pose him pretty well, which is good because I love that for my figure. I will say this for his sword. This uh, th this was a pain in the butt to uh to stick when I first got him, and uh, you will have and uh, I'm probably I'm probably the only one, but it was really annoying. For, it was really annoying. For putting that sword on him and uh i just hope that i just hope that you guys don't have the same well experience with me for that so how good is he well he's loose but his but his legs but his legs are pretty good you can pose him like anything you can pose him anyway just be careful with uh just be careful with, with, with how you pose him because, well, I don't want you guys figures. I don't, I don't want like, I don't want like any of you guys figures to break. That's a no no. <laughs> so yeah. Huh? Okay, okay. But yeah, this first off the scope rise. This looked just like the boy from the future when he first fought Frieza. And well. He killed Frieza, sliced him, then he blasted King Cole. And look at that, in the sword, in the sword piece came out. Okay, okay, this is exactly this, this is exactly what I'm talking about. See, Here we go. But yeah, this this scope, ah, oh, shit, this scope and all that look, look just like the one from the anime. When when this when this man literally said, "Oh yeah, Goku is the only Super Saiyan." But what, what did he do next? He went Super Saiyan, did bring it to, bring an attack on Frieza, then sliced and made pieces like a freaking pizza. Then went then. King Cole tried to attack him, but but uh, he stopped King Cole's attack, blasted him in the chest, and killed him. Bro was a savage when he when he appeared in the show as that. Trunks is just that guy. Hence why the Cell Saga and Android Arc Android Saga is my all time favorite saga in well in Dragon Ball Z history. Because it's just it'll just that good though. <laughs> I'm sorry, it'll just that good. Better than Boo Saga, so don't at me. Yeah, this this looked just like trunks in the 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 the, fr the freaking the freaking uh, face scope. Oh boy! Now, funny though, he comes with two of these, and uh, I'm, and uh, I I'm going to guess I'm going to I think I know why he comes with two. For one, before we come, we come. Okay, so in the anime, so in the anime, trunks had trunks had like two. So before trunks trans. Trunk had like that post transformation when his hair was still purple, but at the same time there was, there was a golden Super Saiyan aura, you can say around him. And uh, I'm gonna guess that I'm gonna guess that that is what the other hair piece was for, to to represent to, to represent that one scene in the show with that, which is okay. That makes sense, but at the same time, 
I don't. I think it was unnecessary for to have two pieces. Of, two pieces of this, but I'll show you. What, I'll show you what I'm talking about. But yeah. Oh boy, let's talk, let, let's go on and talk about his accessory because we got a lot of talk about this guy. Well, yeah. You you know, just like how every essay figure is, you know, we're coming with a lot of accessories because boy, oh boy, this guy comes a lot, all right? Here's the other. Well, here's the other. uh Here's the other head hair scope I was talking about. If you take well this off, like here, and put in this one. Let me fix that. And here he is. This is the boy from the future. <laughs> to be honest, this look. To be honest, this look. This look like this look like a little bit well. Way better on him, but that's just my opinion. So his, so his head, his us uh, head scope. All right, that's okay. That's, okay, let's go another way. He comes with a. Here is his trunks head scope. And uh, I will say, they. Okay, okay. He uncovered. I wish that he come with like I wish that he came with another head scope. I mean, I mean like another face, because just like with the uh, just like with the freaking uh, armor trunks. Well, well yeah, the armor trunks. This trunks right here. He only come. He he only come. He only come with, with like one head scope, one base head scope. That's this. I wish that I wish that he came with another one because. I would, I would, I would love to have more base trunks, head scopes, faces that are well, ha have like different expressions because that would be so cool, and uh, that'll be that that'll be really good as well. But uh, yeah, so, so does the head scope work on him? Yeah, actually it does. You know, be gentle, by the way, with this. This figure is uh, not my favorite, but uh, yeah. It's freaking source. <laughs> and here's the head scope. Overall. Oh god, this lighting is so annoying. Overall, this look just like well, this this well, this look just like him from the anime. <laughs> Again, I wish he had like I wish he had like more face expressions because this would be that that would be a really cool idea that I can see happen in the future. But that's just my opinion. Uh, let me take let me take this off screen. And fix this. Do, 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 do. Alright. <laughs> so his uh accessories. Here we have his well his chop hands. Well You know we all know his infamous burning attack in uh well <laughs> the moth the motherfucker the motherfucker did so sorry. The man did so many hand hand signatures for his, well, for his uh, for his pose and uh, I'm trying to say that he he I'm trying to say that he didn't use these he didn't use these for that because I don't remember him have I don't actually wait, hold on that's a lie he he did he used this hand his hand signature when he fought Mega Frieza when he blasted Frieza in the middle of pieces. I'm sorry, my I totally forgot that for a second. Here we have his full on hand, his hand, 
his full on open hand, his infinite, his infinite pose, his burning attack! <laughs> uh, I love that move. Trunks was just that guy in this freaking South Saga. Well, Android Saga, but you get what I mean. And we have his other palm hands. You can make him use to. You, you can make him use like for fight poses. Alexa, turn off. So sorry about that. But uh, yeah. And here we have his op here we have his hands you can use for well his sword. I'm sorry, but uh did my camera my camera's acting blurry, hold on. That's much better. You can use these for his sword because well because well these are these are meant for his sword because they have like an open grip. And speaking of over grip, if you if you need like if you need like a tougher hand for his swords, well, you have well you have these two. And the last thing he comes with, well, his freaking his freaking uh, faces. Because he has, he has like three of them. Here we have his mad face. I I don't know why, but uh, I don't know why, but uh, he's looking he's looking the he's looking he's looking in the at the side of his eye, but uh, here here we have his, his anger face, his screaming face, and well, his serious face. Why is he looking? Why, why is he looking over there for his uh, serious face? I, I don't know. This, 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 the choices they made for this guy was pretty weird, but uh, but yeah. So now on to size comparison. Okay. Oh boy, we got. I got oh. I got a lot to say about him. Okay, so let's move these out of the way. Let's get let's get uh Trunksy Boy. Trunksy Boy in a good standing pose. Hey, here he is with uh here here he is with the SH oh shit damn. my life. Here he is with well his father. Who I, who who I reviewed last time and you guys really love that. You guys really love that video, which makes me super happy. Here he is with with the figure that my good friend Starblast calls him, uh, the full Dookie, uh, super the full power Dookie Super Saiyan Goku. Yeah, anyone remember Budokai Tenkaichi Three? Because that game. Not three, me too, because that game was so much fun. And uh, I remember, and uh, every time, every time I see this trio right here, I think of that opening, showing off Trunks, Goku, and Vegeta fighting Frieza, Turles, Cell, Baby, Android 13, and uh, Super Boo. Cause that, cause that, that opening was so fire, though. I miss that game so much. Hey, anyway, I can't wait for BT4. Speaking of trunks, here he is with well, here he is with the armor trunks. <laughs> well, <laughs> I find it funny though because in the anime, trunks got a growth spurt after it came out of the hyperbolic time chamber. But uh, here, he's way more shorter and smaller than uh, his new, his well, his 
well, then his 2.0 counterpart. And since it's just a trunk video, let's, let's, put, let's, put, him, let's put him next to well, his master. Well, this version is his master, but uh, you get what I mean. Crazy though, he's almost at the exact same height as Future Trunks. <laughs> really, that's actually crazy, and this figure still holds up to this very day. Fun fact, this was actually my first SH figure art right here, this Gohan. Here he is for, here he is for well, Piccolo. I need to get a superhero Piccolo, because this Piccolo looks, this, this Piccolo, I'm not a big fan of this figure at all. And just because, and just because, I just thought it would be cool because the because Future Trunks never saw this, saw this version of his father and well Goku, he saw the super version of them in, in their god form. But uh, here he is, here he is with the Super Saiyan Four Goku, and here he is with well Super Saiyan Four Vegeta. I love both. I love these Super Saiyan 4 figures. God damn it. Tamashi, make us a Gogeta already, you cowards. All right. Let's move down the way. Yeah, yeah. With the Lightning Collection, Diamond Thunder Black. And yeah, I will, I will get to his review. Oh, let me, uh. Let me fix his shoes there. All right. And here he is with the SA figure of Kamara Gates Survival. Gates Survive, meant to say. And uh, here he is with well, Zeal 2. Ha, ah, get it? Since both of the, since Kamara Zeal is a show talk about, talk about the future and all that. And well, a future Saiyan, met future Saiyan with two future Kamen Rider. Well, one future comma right, the other one's from the present timeline, but you get what I mean. I just I just need I just need Miguel O'Hare of well, well, Spider Man twenty ninety nine to get here, but uh, he won't come till like next year, so yeah. But anyway, yeah, moving aside from that. My honest thoughts on this guy. Uh he's good, but uh damn, my copy damn uh, I wish that I wish that he could be better. He's not bad, no. Is he better? Is he better than Aguilera's figure art? Well, Aguilera, Aguilera's figure was, in my opinion, still mediocre at best. But at the same time, that figure was really decent. But but yeah, by the fact that uh they were just reusing Sakura's mold for that, like they they basically were. I'm, I'm not even mad about that guy. I don't I don't even have the Genie figure art. But uh. That figure, I'll say, way better than this one. Because I'm, because I, I like this. I like that his legs are loose. I do, but, uh, can't forgive this. Can't forgive that, though. My copy felt like it was missing something, and, uh, yeah. I'll say he's good, but not, but not the best. And his sword comes. I hate this so much. <laughs> I hate, I hate that was. I hate that for his sword. Try and recreate that one image he did to sell in the South Saga when he came back from the future. Yeah, <laughs> try my best, but uh, but yeah, but yeah, this figure, this, this, this figure, in fact, could have been my top 10, but uh, since I got the US release for this guy, and uh, my copy, my copy is good, but at the same time, he's not the best, and that, well, that just, that just, it, it irks me that, it just irks me that my super, my somewhat loose, but not super loose, but loose, if he wasn't losing all that, if if you're like, well, 
if my copy was like this version, this copy of Super Vegeta, of Super Saiyan Vegeta, then uh, I would have, I would have loved the figure even more. But it's just that, uh, it's just that he, it's just that uh, my copy felt very loose. I don't know. I feel like it felt like someone Tomashi was just doing a half-assed job on this copy of the figure, and that that just disappoints me. But uh, yeah. If I if I had to grade him, I'll give him a C. He's good. He's okay, but at the same time, I wish he could have been better. But that's just me. But uh, yeah. But yeah. Thank you all for watching. I hope I hope you all enjoyed the video. Please like, comment, subscribe, follow on my social media is in the description, and follow my Twitch account because I just started live streaming on there yesterday. And uh, well, you know, well. I have plans. I have plans on streaming this whole entire summer. So yeah, it'll be at twitch.tv slash bookshot15. I'll put the link in the description. And uh, yeah, my name's Aaron, and I'm out. Enjoy the pictures, guys. Have a nice day. Bye. Bye. And well, peace.